As the sun dipped below the horizon, casting a golden hue over the picturesque town of Sakura, Detective Aiko Tanaka stepped into the quaint tea house. The air was thick with the scent of jasmine and the whispers of gossip, creating an atmosphere ripe with intrigue. The soft clinking of porcelain cups accompanied her as she approached Riku Nakamura, the art critic whose scathing review had haunted the late artist, Haruto Saito. Aiko noted the shadows under Rika's eyes and the way his fingers trembled slightly as he stirred his tea. This was no ordinary meeting. It was a crucial step in unraveling the mystery surrounding Haruto's untimely demise. With a steady voice, Aiko began her inquiry, probing into the complexities of Riku's relationship with the deceased artist. The tension in the room was palpable, as if the very walls were listening in on their conversation. Aiko's keen instincts were on high alert, sensing that Riku's words held the key to unlocking the truth behind the artist's tragic end. The tea house was alive with the murmur of patrons, yet Detective Aiko Tanaka's focus was solely on Riku Nakamura. His discomfort was evident, his eyes darting around as if the walls might betray him. It was complicated, he admitted, his voice tinged with guilt. Aiko pressed on, her pen poised over her notepad, capturing every nuance of his confession. The review he had written must have stung, she suggested, and Rika's response was a mix of regret and defensiveness. I didn't mean for it to hurt him, he confessed, his voice cracking under the weight of his emotions. The tension in the room was mirrored by the cherry blossoms outside, dancing in the evening breeze. Aiko's instincts sharpened as she leaned in, asking if he ever felt threatened by Haruto. Rika's eyes darted to the window, a flicker of jealousy crossing his face. This was a pivotal moment in the investigation, a revelation that could lead to uncovering the truth behind Haruto's death. Detective Aiko Tanaka's mind raced as she pieced together the fragments of evidence she had gathered. The letters she had found in Haruto's studio hinted at a deeper rivalry, one that could potentially lead to murder. The attic in Haruto's studio beckoned, promising secrets that could unravel the tangled web of deceit surrounding the artist's demise. Aiko noted the time, 6.45 p.m., before excusing herself from the tea house, her heart pounding with the weight of the evidence she was beginning to piece together. This was a critical juncture in the investigation, where every clue and every deduction could bring her closer to the truth. The atmosphere was charged with anticipation as Aiko prepared to delve deeper into the mystery, determined to uncover the secrets hidden within the shadows of Haruto's life and death. Thank you for joining us on this intriguing journey through the investigation of Haruto Sato's mysterious death. As Detective Aiko Tanaka delves deeper into the tangled web of secrets and rivalries, the suspense continues to build. Stay tuned to the Storyteller channel for more updates and revelations as the case unfolds. Don't forget to follow and subscribe to ensure you don't miss any crucial developments in this captivating mystery. Join us as we continue to explore the depths of detective work, uncovering the truth one clue at a time. Until next time, keep your wits sharp and your curiosity piqued as we unravel the mysteries that lie ahead.